today let's make some kombusito, a recipe from Hokkaido. First we have to roast the kombu over a fire. Okay, so we'll roast it over a fire. And you hear it popping? Okay, I think it's good. Sometimes they catch on fire, so you gotta be careful. So here we have the kombu. I'm going to keep rumble it up. And you can tell some parts may not have been um, roasted well because they're still kind of like rubbery. You want it to be really crispy. So those that didn't get, well, just put it on the side and save it for your soup. This is where having fingers that can feel come in handy. Okay. <clears throat> Dusty. Then you get your suribachi. Oh, this is a suribachi. And you start mashing them by hand. Ideally, you could put this in a coffee grinder, but then you get all that chaotic electric energy in your food. You want to have it nice and sugarized with love. Because you shouldn't come have love. like that. I'm going to put it into your little pot here. You might want to wear a mask because this is dusty. Whew. Okay. Then, like that, I'm going to double the recipe. I'm going to add a little bit of ginger that I dried the whole piece because it was, it's kind of still cold. Then I got a, it's really dusty, see? Okay. And then some kind of sweetener. I got some uh, rock sugar from Japan. Not too sweet. Okay, and then to this we we'll add a little bit of water. Not too much because we want this to be a gelatinous sauce. Okay, let's go take it to the stove. Okay, here we are at the stove. You want to cook it up so that the sugar melts. That was quick, the sugar melted. And boil it up a little bit until it gets thick. So it's starting to, there's some action going on in there, see? It's starting to sizzle. That's a wrong word. I don't know what this is called. Bubbling. Okay. Turn it down. Okay, it's bubbling. And sometimes English is really hard when you didn't grow up with it. And then you can taste it to see if it's, you know, sweet or not sweet. It doesn't have to be sweet. You don't even have to put sugar in here, actually. Mm. But if you don't, it's going to be really salty. So I think I want to add a little bit more sugar. I added another chunk. I mix it till it's nice and gooey. See the texture starting to change? Okay. Okay, it's done. Kombusito. I know it looks gross, but it's really good. So I'm going to add this. Ideally, you, should, you can add this to your um, mochi or tofu.
tofu or chicken or something but I'm gonna add it to my rice because I don't have mochi and then I'm going to add some bonito look watch this the bonitos alive that's my mid-morning snack <laughs> 